Charles or Charlie from the Hollywood Undead. How's, how's your name and so uh, far? It's kind of early. I just woke up about five minutes ago. As the sun glasses. So, so far it's been great. Beautiful day. Oh, I love your facetiousness. <laughs> It's yep. very good. Comes across. Yeah, subtle. <laughs> subtle. So you all are playing at one. Yeah. And uh, this is the first year you've played Rock on the Range? This is the uh, third year we've been here now. Main stage? Main stage, yeah. Usually we play later on, but I guess we suck that bad that they're putting us on this early. Yeah, yeah. Totally. I think we'll say that we're that you're lubing the stage up for everybody else. Yeah, lubing so it. Move the stage, man. Move the stage. Great. So, Hollywood like Undead, you've got the Day of the Dead out. Yeah. Um, you all started releasing singles pretty much weekly. Yeah. So, what made you go into that direction? I mean, the trickle down effect, what did you expect that would do for the album? Um, well, uh, it like builds the hype and stuff, you know, like a lot of people don't buy records anymore, so you just kind of release a song a week and get people excited about it and uh, tweeting it and telling people about it. So, I don't know. So, you know, kids don't buy records. Well, assholes. You know? And then, uh, so now you gotta try new, like, methods. So that's okay. what we're doing now. Okay. Hollywood on the <laughs> Day of the Dead. Um, Sean Gould? Was yeah, Sean Gould. First time you used uh, this producer for yeah. your album. So what, what made you use him? Um, he was someone that, uh, he was an engineer on, uh, our second record we did, he's just an engineer guy who worked with these producers, Sam and Sluggo, and uh, he started producing and we like him a lot as a person and we know that he's, he's good as an engineer, so we thought we'd give him a try and we're glad that we did because uh, he did some really good stuff. And I noticed there was a big section where there, uh, there was a link to a site that had a bunch of accolades from various artists. Jonathan Davis from the floor had a lot of nice things to say about Hollywood Undead. So, what are your thoughts about getting these accolades from other artists? And then, do you have any accolades you'd like to dish out? Whoa, uh, well, yeah, that was cool just because, you know, we grew up listening to bands like Korn and stuff, and then just to get. Um, Recognized or have someone like that uh, even listen to your stuff or know who you are is kind of cool. And then for them to say something nice is pretty bitchy. Did you bitchin'. have a fangasm? Yeah, I, yeah, Snobby. I did. Major Snobby fangasm. fangasm. I did, and uh, I definitely had a fangasm. Here he fan he uh, idolgasmed in my mouth too because I had to suck his dick for him to fucking say that those nice things. We don't say dick on rock or roll. We can say it constantly. Oh, the, what? We can I say what? Say we say dick constantly on rock and roll. Oh, oh we do? Oh, that's just, we do, I'm sorry. You can say dick again. Oh, okay, cool. So yeah, it's dick. It's pretty nice, so. Uh, that was cool. Yeah, and there's a lot of young men out there with nice dicks, too. So I just want to say that, you know, to be nice to the young so men. So the accolade that's coming out is like, uh, Hollywood Undead appreciates every young man's dick. Yeah. I've been also stalking your video. Mm-hmm. You're doing a lot of stalking. I do. I'm, I'm kind of creepy that way. Yeah. Kind of sticky. I can tell. Yeah. Because sticky creeps and moist. Over here. Sticky and moist. That's the way I describe myself online. Yeah, that's why we're in the moist, creep tent. Moist, sticky, and sweet. This is the creep tent, right? Yeah. Yeah. We get naked later. Oh, cool. Like, when you leave, it's all pants off. <laughs> pants off in the press tent. <laughs> yep. Yeah, most people have their pants off already. The camera can't see, but there's a lot of naked dudes in here. And I'm pretty sure that they're shooting us from the waist up, so they yeah. don't know what's going on from the waist down. Exactly. You don't want to. You don't want to see what's going on down here. So, with your new your video, there's a lot of a, a lot of interesting points of view coming along. There's a lot of criticism um, about you know the evangelical and mm -hmm. so. Did you all have a lot of input onto this? I mean, it, I, I thought it was very fascinating from a sociological standpoint. Yeah. So, what is uh, your take on it? Uh, no, we did have a lot of imp input, and uh, whenever we have a song coming out, I think all bands, you get like a bunch of different um, treatments from a lot of different directors, and a lot of them have like just run-of-the-mill music videos, and I like the televangelist idea, or the whole band did, because it was something different. And, uh, and for some reason, a lot of the kids didn't get it. But uh, to me, it's one of I love the video. It's one of our best. But I think kids, they just want to see like the basic shit, like us in a fucking cemetery or yeah. running through a fucking mental hospital, a weird trippy shit. I like that because it was something new. I think a lot of kids just don't remember the whole Tammy Faye here. Yeah. Reference. I yeah. was like, I am that. Yes. Yeah, I remember that. Me too. I'm 47. 
You're giving yourself a good Thank you very much. Thank you, yeah. It's like a lot of celebrity dick. That'll do it. Keeps young. It keeps you young. A lot of celebrity we dick had a, sucking will we, keep you We had you a bad young. meeting, too, where they're like, dude, too much gay references and in interviews, but like, I just woke up, so that's all I got. That's all I guess. Yeah. What songs off of uh, your latest album are going to be? show today. Um, one, because you need to wake yourself up. Yeah, exactly. Anyways, Day of the Dead, we're going to play. We're going to play uh, a song called, uh, 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 fucking, I forget, too early. And then uh, War Child. War Child. We're going to do War Child. It should have been your face. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That one's so good. We might play it a few times, too. We might just play that song three times. 